Yo, it's your boy Mo coming at you from my balcony here in Medellin, Colombia. And in today's video, we're going to be talking about five common low testosterone symptoms in young men. All right, so a couple of years ago, my health was completely on the floor. I was lazy, I was tired, I could barely crawl out of bed in the morning, my waistline was expanding, and to make matters worse, at the tender age of being in my early 20s, my sex drive was nowhere to be seen. All right, now all of these issues today I know are uh, common symptoms of low testosterone, but at the time, I thought that low testosterone was something that only older guys had to worry about. But either way, I, dubbed, uh, I dug deeper into the research and found that yes, this could be a possible a manifestation of low testosterone. So long story short, I went to get my blood test done. When the results came back, my level was at 564 nanograms per deciliter. Now this is a level considered well within the so-called normal range, but it was also the level at which I was experiencing all of these symptoms. And then diving deeper into the research, I found that 564 nanograms per deciliter was actually a level closer to the average for a man more than twice my age. And the problem with the so-called normal range that the labs present you with is that it includes a sample of every single person who's had their testosterone level measured at that particular lab. So whether it's an 80 year old diabetic or whether it's a 20 year old fit young athlete, all of them are given equal weight within this normal range. And uh, after taking the steps to naturally increase my total testosterone from 564 to 902 nanograms per deciliter, which you can read about in my free email course linked below, it goes over everything that I did and how you can get the same results. But long story short, doing so not only erased all of these symptoms that I was experiencing earlier on, but it also radically altered the trajectory of my life whereby I'm moving towards expressing what I am truly capable of being, all right? So, what are the five common symptoms of low testosterone in young men? Well, the first symptom that has been shown in multiple studies is depression, all right? Now, in one study, they brought in more than 3,500 men and uh, assessed them for depressive symptoms as well as their testosterone levels. And what they found was, that the men with the lower testosterone levels were also at an increased chance for having symptoms of depression, all right? Now, back when uh, I was in my early 20s and before I started on this journey, like I said, I had difficulty crawling out of bed in the morning. Now, whether that was depression or not, I don't know, but it was something that uh, really held me back from expressing who I truly was, all right? Who I was truly capable of being. So if, you, if those uh, Monday blues have turned into an everyday thing and you feel like your mood is always on the low, then uh, taking the steps to naturally increase your testosterone levels can definitely help, all right? And this is because uh, actually the exact mechanisms of how testosterone impacts your mood are not exactly known, but studies have shown that when men with depression are given exogenous sources of testosterone or testosterone injections, they report significant improvements in their mood, all right? So the relationship between testosterone and mood has been clearly demonstrated in the research, but the exact mechanisms of how testosterone impacts mood are not exactly known, all right? So the first symptom of low testosterone in young men is depression. And that brings us to the second symptom of low testosterone in young men, and that is brain fog. Now, brain fog can be manifested in a number of different ways, some of which are difficulty concentrating, lack of focus, just the scattered thoughts, and uh, just a, a decreased memory as well. So these are just some of the many manifestations of brain fog, all right? And uh, research does show that low testosterone levels are associated with decreased levels of cognition, all right? And another interesting finding is that men with low levels of testosterone have an increased risk of developing Alzheimer's disease, all right? Now, ex again, the exact mechanisms of how testosterone impacts brain health are not exactly known. But some preliminary research uh, points to the fact that testosterone plays a role in preventing brain tissue decay. So if your body is not producing optimal levels of testosterone, then your brain cells will not be functioning near their peak 
potential. So, if you've been experiencing any of these symptoms of brain fog, then it's likely that suboptimal testosterone levels are a contributing cause. And that brings us to the third low testosterone symptom in young men, and that is increased body fat. Now, studies have consistently found that men with lower levels of testosterone have significantly higher amounts of body fat percentage. Now, the relationship between testosterone and body fat is actually twofold, all right? It goes both ways. So not only does low testosterone leave you at an increased risk of carrying more body fat, but all that excess body fat actually furthers, further lowers your testosterone because body fat produces an enzyme called aromatase. And aromatase is an enzyme that converts testosterone into the female sex hormone estrogen all right so this is really a negative cycle that you really have to break out of and this is why i tell all the guys that i work with that the first step they need to do in order to naturally optimize their testosterone levels is get rid of all those extra inches around their waist because not only does excess body fat lower your testosterone i mean not only is uh, excess body fat associated with lower levels of testosterone but all that excess body fat would further lower your testosterone by converting it into estrogen all right now the fourth symptom of having low levels of testosterone is decreased muscle and strength all right now you already know that testosterone is the primary driver of muscle growth and having low levels of testosterone are closely related with an inability to gain muscle and strength all right but again like is the case with body fat the relationship between muscle and strength and testosterone actually goes both ways as well all right so not, when you take the steps to naturally increase your testosterone a critical component of that is building muscle and strength because the more muscle you have on your body the more of a demand your body will have to produce testosterone so not only will lifting weights in itself increase your testosterone levels right after the workout but then building the muscle will increase the demand of testosterone that your body needs to sustain that muscle but if you're not strength training if you're not lifting weights if you're not increasing your strength then not only will that decrease your uh, muscle and strength it will also decrease your testosterone levels because there's no demand for it to be produced all right and that brings us to the fifth and final low testosterone symptom in, lo in young men and that is the loss of libido or sex drive all right now this is usually the first symptom that comes up in a lot of guys and uh, it's the first symptom that they realize when they wake up with a lack of morning wood and that's no surprise because testosterone is the primary male sex hormone and if you're not producing enough of it then not only will your biological ability to reproduce for example produce sperm be reduced but also your psychological capacity to desire sex will be reduced as well all right now all of these five symptoms were to some extent what i experienced during my time as uh having during my time of having suboptimal testosterone levels and they have completely disappeared since i've taken the steps to naturally increase my levels and as i said if you want to know about exactly what steps i took to achieve the results that i got then check out my free email course below it's seven days and each step, each day has a particular action step that you can take in order to move towards a life of more energy health well-being and narrowing the gap between the man you are and the man you're capable of being with all that being said this has been mo salim from triple and i'll see you soon